what's cool, what's cool, what's happening? It's time for live. Time to make some food. So, this is some fish I got really discounted. And I mixed it up with some potatoes and some Brussels sprouts and a lot of herbs, okay? And it came out looking this crunchy. Now, my lighting is bad because I did not actually bring my ring light to film this because, you know, whatever. But, um, yeah, please subscribe. So there's some onions so this is just rice with oh everything is in here with some peppers some olives you know and see that chicken oh that's an earthquake see that chicken that i made earlier on just put that in there this is some tomatoes a lot of herbs and basil there's a basil and there's some ginger cube in there maggie cube blend it all up it looks kind of weird the color is kind of odd then turns kind of green so then I put it in a pan and put some meatballs in there. And I think they were unseasoned meatballs. Just threw them in there and they cooked nicely. That's a salad that I made. I just put the chicken and some cherry tomatoes and some cucumbers and whatever else I got. So this is my Brussels sprout potato cheap fish from Little Situation. The fish was discounted, y'all. Go after seven and you'll get some good goodies so yeah this is my fried rice this is my basil soup which looks weird but that stuff was delicious okay really nice really, really nice very flavorful there's actually some spinach kind of stew that I made um, yeah it's just kind of onions you you kind of fry it up and then you add tomatoes and you fry that up with it and then once that's kind of a stew you put the spinach in there and yeah turned out not to be a lot of spinach because the loose leaf spinach and that's all the dishes that I made Ooh, so tasty it was and this this I was really proud of so I can't really tell you what the recipe was for this because I kind of just did something it rose so so well but I didn't really taste much of bread because I added a lot of normal flour and I poked a hole in it to see if it's done but you only kind of do that with cake right so I don't know why I did that but anyway see how it rolls so beautifully and how spongy it is and so mm, yes okay it was nice it was nice um yeah put some butter on it I love me some butter that's how my bread cut up and in a roll it goes beautifully with that salad that I was talking about so salad is basically all the veggies that I had just roaming around and then oh i forgot i made some shortbread too because being lactose intolerant i can't have the ones in the shop technically can't and i made some waffles you saw that didn't you so yeah i made some waffles to do it kind of flat but whatever so yeah these are all the meals that i made it's kind of a lot of food and it lasted me a long time do you want to know how long it lasted me no this is not gross you guys okay i put it in the uh what do you call it i put it in the deep freezer okay so this lasted me two weeks now don't get it twisted if you come to my house and i invite you for a meal or whatever i'm not gonna give you two week old food okay you're gonna get fresh cooked on that day if i cook the minute you know cook just finished cooking the minute you walked into my door kind of food okay you're gonna get it fresh but this food since it's just for me and i don't care and i don't have time to be cooking a lot i just stood there and took several hours cooked all this food and for the next two weeks i did not have to cook anything so that was good that was great obviously i kind of went for the salad first and stuff because that goes bad but yeah everything else was just frozen and i just went for it as i needed it as and when i needed it and the bread went very well with the salad but also went really well with the soup so that was really nice and that's all my tupperwares and they're full of food and it was pretty amazing yeah so that was the end